Okay, you shot the match. That's just great. So, we're looking at the primary tablet or device that you're going to use to upload this to practice score, and that's great. Now, unless you took this uh, primary device out on the range with you and used it for one of the squads, essentially it doesn't have any information on how the other squads uh, did shoot and uh, be able to consolidate and so forth. So let's go back and take a look at our two tablets that we had uh, out on the range. Uh, the one on the left, uh, tablet 0143, you can see the number down in the lower left hand corner. Let's go over and uh, check the entered scores and we'll do the same with the other tablet here. And we had uh, five stages and they operated independently and so forth. Now, just to give you a clue when you're looking at this, and I'll try to get the camera just oriented here. The tablet on the left was squad one. It only had five shooters. So five of the total 11 were scored in uh, stages one down through five. And then over here on the second tablet or squad two, they had six shooters and six of the 11 were all scored as far as those go. Uh, let me just show you what uh, we're talking about here. I'll just uh, arbitrarily pick here on stage, excuse me, squad one, and we'll look at the results. And you can see the scores that you've got for that particular stage for that particular squad. Well, that's great, but that's on this tablet. Again, you can see the tablet number down in the lower left-hand corner. And over here, you can see this tablet. So what we need to do is transfer this information to the primary tablet, which we've got set up right here. So the way we're going to do that is we're going to sync the devices. And if you notice, it's popped up here, and I'll get in, zoom in real close here. You can see that the two Android devices, 0143 and 148, are listed there. So pretty straightforward uh, situation here. I'll just hold the camera steady, and what we're going to do is since all of the devices are all on the same network here, I'll just tap that and tap that. So it's reading, if you will, it's ready to pull from the selected tablets. Now, if you had more devices in the neighborhood and all, they'd all be listed there, but that's not really a problem. So I'll just come over here and I'll tap the pull from selected. And there they are. They've pulled in the scores. Okay. So I'm going to go up here and I'm going to apply the changes. And I pulled it into the uh, primary tablet here. So I'll just keep backing up. You can follow me. So now I've got everything all lined up here and everything is now on the primary tablet, primary device. Now, it is very important before you do the post, the practice score, is that you want to take a look at the uh, information because you want to make sure that all the information is uh, properly uh, listed there. If you have any uh, did not fire or incomplete times and so forth, you're going to have to go back to your secondary devices and adjust those, find out what the situation is. You might have to delete a shooter the, in case there were two listed there. Uh, two uh, shooters, the same shooter, and they're on the squad, but they only had the scorers against one name, so you have to delete the other name. Those are some situations that we found. So uh, let's go over here and review, quick view the results, and what we want to do is look at the match scores, and we want to look at the combined, and this is what I was trying to do with an earlier video that you may be looking at, is I'll zoom in here close and you notice that under the column labeled final, every shooter has a time. You want to have that. If you don't, then none of this is going to work very well for you. And if you notice across the way, you can uh, look at the column headings and see the different names of the stages, uh, their raw time, any penalties, bonuses they might have gotten in individual shooting time. But if you see a final time listed here on the practice score, you're good to go, and you could upload this to practice score, and you're all done. What am I talking about? Well, you come back over here, and we back up, and the match results, and, and I'm not going to do it because it would actually post it to practice score, but you can see the one tab down here that's labeled post to practice score. 
we would tap that and voila, it's uh, uploaded to the internet, it, to the cloud, and to practice score, and you're all done. And you can uh, breathe a sigh of relief and move on to something else uh, as far as other matches and whatnot. Uh, do your financial report and you're all done. Thank you very much. Bye.